Hello everybody and welcome back to Sven Plays. The android is on the loose. This is my window. Oh! Hi! No you don't! Oh, balls. No, you are not helping me. Bugger off. Oh, decidedly not going that way. My objective is... Oh, in that room still. Seriously. I'm not going to run, but... I really just want to check my email. Come on then. Oh, it's open now. Gas torch. Come on. Come on, lady. There's literally an android up behind you. No hurry or anything. Okay. Oh, fuck, he knows I'm here. Come on. Uh, I'm pretty sure he saw me. I don't know. I just thought maybe we could, you know, be friends or something. You're right, there is no need for this. You could just rack right off. Uh, that's the thing I need to use the plasma torch for. Okay. If you say so. Seriously, what are these things good for? Okay. I don't know if I if I actually did anything. Ah, uh, son of a bitch. Oops. You androids are so annoying. You're not even scary anymore. You're just an inconvenience. And let me guess. This will take a while to do. Yeah. No, this isn't gonna work. Yeah, just keep punching me. I'm just trying, I'm basically doing this just so I can get a sense of how long this will take. And I literally don't think I can do this as long as the android is still present. So. What can I do? I don't have enough bullets to kill the android. The stun baton won't take it out. But that's clearly a spot where the android will see me. me ah! Ah, it's too risky with him right there. I need him to go like around the corner or be facing the opposite way. Ah, he just keeps turning back this way. I need to turn the panel, but I can't without him knowing I'm there. Ah, uh, fuck. Seriously? He's gonna come around this way anyway. Come on now. Quickly, quick, 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 quick. Don't take your time or anything. Well, I kept him distracted for a while, but it's very risky to go past him right now. Mm. Oh boy, I've gone into a bad spot. Oh boy, oh boy. No, 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 no! Come around this way. Go around that way. I 
I don't know if it saw me or not. Damn it, I don't know how I'm going to deal with that thing before I go picking that up. Save. <sighs> Son of a bitch, this is just... Uh. Gas torch. But how am I going to create a window of opportunity to open that door? Can I make any more noisemakers? No. What do I have? What can I make? I could stun him, but that, that won't take him out. These things, like take a... Oh, no, no. Shit. Uh, I can make another Molotov, but I don't know if Molotovs are going to do any good against that thing. I can make another Noisemaker. That's my single best chance, but I'm going to need to throw it in the right place. Throwing stuff in this game is actually... Really difficult to get to go where you want. And I can't save again yet. <sighs> Why can I not save to save right as many times as I want? Okay. First one. Listen, you crazy bastard. You think that thing gets around in a fucking transit car? You're sitting in an override that will disconnect the transit from Apollo. So fucking pull it. You can stop all this bullshit just by pulling a lever. You think you're safe with the transit powered down, but we're trapped like rats. For God's sake, help us! Double crossed. Got a heads up for you, jackass. Don't even think about throwing in with Sinclair and the Seeks and security guys. I told them it was you that killed Morrison. If they see you, they'll shoot on sight. You should have let me join you in your bolt hole. You won't last a week. Yeesh. Everyone in this place is just such... Horrible people. Can I save again now, please? Thank God. I just don't want to have to pick up all that shit again and figure out my options. Okay. The android will be on his patrol, but he has that route that comes back up. I don't think the plasma cutter is probably going to be so loud as well. Where is the android? I have no idea where he is. He's standing still at the moment. Obviously. Oh, he's still there. Okay. So, he can totally see me from there. Uh, what choice do I have? I wonder if a smoke bomb will cover me long enough. Probably not. Mm -hmm. Uh, this takes so long. Wanna cut a little faster, lady? Uh, I'm completely exposed now. I'm just gonna get straight in there. Seriously? You didn't move that whole fucking time? Not that I'm complaining, mind you, but... Okay. Now what? Ah, here we go. Ripley, this is Waits. The transit's here and we're waiting on you. Take it. I had some trouble, so it's gonna take me a while to get back. We can wait. Taylor can't. I can catch the next car. Your call. Uh, isn't that selfless of her? Guys, it's Sinclair. We need supplies. Take what you can from whoever you want. I found an area in habitation where we can seal ourselves in and wait for rescue. I've got guys welding vents shut and shutting off elevators, plan is to make it watertight. There's no room for more people in the sanctuary, but we can make space for their food, meds, water, and guns. 
If we're gonna get everyone through this alive, there's no room for pity. Ah, I'm back here. Alright. The train's there. No, there's a safe point right here, but... We heard voices as we left. Watch yourself. I'm gonna save before I do anything. Okay. Thank goodness for that. Alright. Voices, he said. Solomon's habitation tower is where I need to be. So it means as soon as I pull this, I'm probably going to get some unwanted attention. Yep. In I go! Alright, they're close. I still think we need more supplies. Guns, food, wherever we can find it. Maybe he's found a better site to raid. Far away off this fucking... That, today's the day we finally seal ourselves in the habitation base. Okay. Now what? I can't hear these guys talk anymore. But I need to get past them. We need more supplies, guns, food, wherever we can find it. Please call our first Solomon's habitation tower. Is there another one coming? Oh, man. Let's go find Sinclair. Hey, no way we should be split. You okay? Up. Safety in numbers. Not even sure of that anymore. That thing is unstoppable. Give me one clear shot. Okay. Keep it together. I hope we can get through this. All right. Does this mean I can get out now? Onto the train, onto the train, onto the train, onto the train. And in the clear. <sighs> I do feel like as you spend more time thinking around the androids and humans, it is way less engaging than the alien. I know that they have to have differences of kind in the gameplay, otherwise it would just get stale. But the other parts of the game should probably still have a similar kind of quality, and I just don't get that from the androids or the humans. They're just not as fun to slip around, if that makes sense. Serving the Solomon's Galleria Mall, Colonial Marshall Bureau, and Seeks and Habitation Suites. Alright, give me a save. Give me an S! A V I N G! Dink! Alright, now what? My objective is that way. Ripley, we're in the Marshall Bureau. Just turn right at the top of the stairs. You can't miss it. No welcome committee? Just get up here. Wait's out. He's a friendly chap. I think in this particular location I don't have to worry about the alien. This area looks nice actually. Fuck the marshals. Sheesh. This place is just falling apart, it's a mess. Calm down, calm down. You're safe now. Waits has a plan. A plan? Really? His fucking plans haven't done us much good so Is that you? Did you get the transit running? Nice work. Maybe we'll be safe here. For now anyway. Alrighty. On would I go, eh? How's Taylor? Stable. Should be walking soon enough. Samuels is with her now. Okay. You managed to get transit up and running, so I guess we're even. Where's Ricardo? Prepping our next move. Look, I'm busy. I've got Marlo in the cells, the lowlife who showed up with your flight recorder. Where's Marlo's ship? The Anisadora. He put it in a parking orbit around the gas giant. Son of a bitch won't give us the command codes to let us bring it in on auto. Maybe you can get more out of the unhelpful bastard. Go talk to him. Okay. And have a save. 
Wait, it said hostiles are nearby. Why does it say that? <laughs> uh, probably a bug in this case is because there's human NPCs near around. Marlo? Who wants to know? My name's Ripley. I'm with the company. Here for your empty box already? You guys are keen, I'll give you that. I'm here for personal reasons. My mother was on the Nostromo when it went missing 15 years ago. You serious? Chips. Well, Chips. We never found her ship, Ripley. Just the recorder. But you sure as hell found something else. What happened out there? I need a way out of here, Ripley. Maybe we can make a deal. Just start talking. I want to know everything. Com check. You get me, Lewis? A little fuzzy, Marlo, but you're coming through. Let's take it slow. I want to get to that beacon in one piece. If you're looking for a piece faster, I've got something for you right here. I'd need scanning equipment to find it, Heist. <laughs> Okay, enough already. Focus on what we're here for. I don't want any mistakes. Well, looks like we're getting Marlo's backstory. There you are. Foster, Meeks, keep your eyes open. Roger. Alright, we'll tell you what, guys. We're going to explore the surface of this lovely place next time on Sven Plays. See you then. Uh, I'm pretty sure you saw me. I don't know. I just thought maybe we could, you know, be friends or something. You're right, there is no need for this. You could just rack right off. <laughs>